Let's now get an update on the doctor strike. The health crisis appears to have deepened Monday with the Kenya issuing a strike notice effective Monday of next week. This comes as the doctor strike entered its 12th day of a deal between government on one side and the doctors on the other. The Council of Governors, however, say that they will work with doctors who are willing to resume work to avoid shutdown of health services. Our reporter, Abiyaziz Hashim, has the details of that story. Pressure continues to mount on medics to call off their strike to pave way for talks. But even before the stalemate is unlocked, clinic officers are now threatening to withdraw their services from Monday. It will be the governor, overwhelmingly, to provide this health service. If I have done everything required by the doctors of Nairobi, they don't have an issue with another employer. The nine days that they don't come to work is absconding of duty. And a bit to ease the suffering of patients, Johnson Sakaja, who was before the Senate Health Committee, says the Council of Governors have resolved to work with doctors. And so because of that, Chair, we have taken the advice of the Council of Governors, we have taken the advice of our, of our lawyers, we are filling our hospitals with doctors who are interested in working with the county. Of healthcare. As they sort out the national problem of interns, because we don't post interns, we will make sure Nairobians get health services every day. told the committee some of the striking doctors heeded to the 12-hour ultimatum to resume to work to avoid losing their jobs. After I said many of them went back to our hospitals, but they were being yanked out of the hospitals by the union. That Tokeni Hapa were not supposed to be here. Yet they have... It is now a game of wait and see who will blink first, with clinic officers now tabling eight ultimatums. They want resolved before Monday. They have threatened to join the doctors on the bench. Abdi Azizashim for Prime Edition.